What's good, people? It's Polar with Slime Green Beast, and this is a basic tutorial tutorial for beginners. And this is how to, uh, like, basically understand notes in the piano roll. I had a user, I had a uh, subscriber ask me, um, and I quote, "Can you do?" This is the Marvel Stark. Uh, the Can you do a tutorial on how to understand notes in the piano roll? They're holding me back so much. I don't know how. Uh, what note should I use if I want to recreate trailer music or any tracks? D, D, he's like D5, A1, it confuses me. Uh, da, 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 da. I would like a tutorial on how to determine instrument by ear for any video. Okay. And piano roll mostly because I want to make something, but I'm lost with the numbers part. Okay. All right. So um, basically, he's trying to understand like how to uh, use piano, what like what the numbers are on the piano roll. So we'll just go right to the piano roll. And number one, the bass note, and this is using a synth. The bass note is always going to be C5. So C5 is like the bass note, and you'll see like on a keyboard, it's just kind of like, it seems like it just kind of starts the rotation of notes. C5 and C6 is like, so C5, and like there's scales, and these, this is highlighting scales right now, and this is, uh, the scale I'm using is, um, I really don't want to change it, so, um, but it's, it's highlighting the C scale minor melodic the cc would be in the root note i would just keep the root note at uh c just to, like not confuse you and then you probably heard something like da, da. you know what i'm saying okay i'm sure you've heard that you could go like do do that's a black note we're not gonna we're not gonna we're gonna ignore the black notes wait a minute Okay, how does it sound? Uh, let's ignore the black notes, and you hear like an actual scale. Ignore the black notes, and you hear the actual scale, I believe. And then it's going to hit C5 and go right back down. You probably like heard this if you're... You know, I was in band, and that's the only reason I know this. Yes, I was in band. Duh. Duh. Dang. Duh. I think. And so you can plug these in or you can also play it. Like if I hit it on the keyboard, you'll see it light up here. So that's just all like the numbers are. The numbers are just notes. C5, D5. And then, you know, there's A, but it really starts at C. So it just goes C, D, E, F, G. This is just going up. And then A, B, C. The black notes kind of get confusing. That's where you get in the sharp zone. And honestly, like, for if you're a beginner, I wouldn't worry too much about that. But, I mean, sometimes, you know, just use your ears and see if it sounds well. Or sounds good. You know, I don't necessarily even really pay attention to scale. So it's not even like you really got to, like, know all this stuff to, like, really be able to make good music. So uh, that's that's that for this uh, tutorial. Just trying to, uh, you know, if hopefully you guys are able to understand these notes better. Remember, try to highlight it if you can. You can snap it here. Or I'm sorry, two ways. Pick. You can pick it here. Right now, I'm just. I, and sometimes I just use random ones. So don't feel obligated to use one or like you have to use one. Just use whatever. Just experiment. See, like. Oh, I make a lot of good beats with this scale. So maybe, maybe it just fits your like play style, you know. So I don't necessarily feel like you have to do one thing or another. Minor melodic. That's what I'm on right now. I just know popularity-wise, minor na the Aeolian scale is very popular, as well as the uh, harmonic scale. Minor harmonic is very popular. And again, when you when you press the scale highlighting, it's gonna highlight the scale for you. But uh, that's it for this tutorial, guys. It's been really than real. And uh, hopefully this tutorial is actually good. And if it's not, leave a down vote. If it's good, leave an up vote. Peace out.